Okay, we're gonna throw these on a chronograph. What we got here is a bare recurve, 52 inch. Um, Kodiak Magnum, I think is what it is. And it, uh, 40 pound pull. And this is the, uh, now we call them fish hawks. I think, I suspect it's made by Matthews. I'm not sure who makes it. But anyway, it, uh, it looks like a Matthews. And it's a 40 pound pull. So, gonna throw these on a chronograph and uh, see what the difference between a 40 pound recurve and a 40 pound compound is. Here we go. Up first is a Cody 8 mag, 40 pound pull, 500 grain arrow. All right, now let's shoot the compound. All right, now we're gonna try the compound. 40 pounds. One eighty four. Big difference. <clears throat> there you go. All right, now we're gonna try a about a 45 pound longbow and a 45 pound recurve. Okay, longbow's up first. Forty-five recurve is on deck. Ninety-eight. <laughs> we'll try that again. That's probably about right, though. One thing that is amazing about the longbow is how quiet it is. I mean, it's just like no slam, no huge vibration. Pretty amazing. The advantage of a longbow is less string pinch, lighter, but they're very slow and they're very long. Hundred ten. Yeah, that's probably that right. Mm -hmm. Now we got the Bear Super Kodiak, forty-five pound pull. Let's see where this goes. One fifty-four. Yep. There you go. And the winner is. Okay, just for giggles, this is an old bear, probably a kid's bow, entry level bow, 35 pound pool. See what it's got under the hood. One eighteen. Ten pounds less. Makes a lot of difference. There you go. Try one more time just to catch the scale live. Yeah. Yeah, it's in the one teens. There you go. All right, this is a 25 pound pool, Genesis Pro.
134. One forty, twenty five pound pull. <laughs> 